The sun doesn't shine every day. The storms will come. There are times when the nights will be long and dark and you will be alone. There will be times when the darkness seems to consume everything. But don't let it consume you. Even in the darkest times, even in the strongest storms, even when the sun is blotted out and the world is falling apart, the darkness cannot extinguish your light. You, your will, your determination, no matter what is happening, no matter how hard the fight is, as long as you keep fighting, you win. Only surrender is defeat, only quitting is the end. When it just doesn't make any logical sense to go on, that's when you use your emotion, your anger, your frustration to push you to say, I don't stop. When your feelings are screaming that you have had enough, override that emotion with concrete logic and willpower that says, I don't stop. Life is one big tug of war, and you don't win that tug of war by pushing the fuck away. You have to pull that motherfucker. And a lot of times you have to pull yourself through life, pull yourself out of bed, pull yourself out of a funk, pull yourself out of whatever the life is throwing at you to gain that confidence. Everybody's got a fucking plan so they can hit the fucking mouth. So when your plan fails, when you get knocked the fuck down on the fucking canvas, when everything falls apart in your life and your plan is fucked up, what the fuck are you going to do? There's only one motherfucking Stay in power. Don't shape yourself around the comings and goings of this world. Don't shape your opinions and your attitudes around circumstances that you cannot change. Be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed. When you get inspired, realize that person is made up of the same whatever it is as you. And the only difference is that person is the one who has fought just that little harder. If we are all only made up of atoms, then why don't you become the stronger energy, the superior one? Can't you see we live off each other and it's the people that shine brightly who affect us positively? Stop waiting for others to do it first and break through and go do it yourself. Look at the four minute mile. People thought it impossible and now every day people can achieve it. If you want something, you can get it. It only takes will. To want and to be ambitious and to want to be successful is not enough. That's just desire. To know what you want, to understand why you're doing it, to dedicate every breath in your body to achieve. If you feel you have something to give, if you feel that your particular talent is worth developing, is worth caring for, then there's nothing you can't achieve. Life's as game of inches. The inches we need are everywhere around us. They're in every break of the game, every minute, every second. In any fight, it's the guy who's willing to die who's gonna win that itch. And I know if I'm gonna have any life anymore, it's because I'm still willing to fight and die for that itch. It is not easy, but I'm not about to quit. I'm not about to give up, and I'll do whatever it takes to maintain it. When living life, try new things. Jump, fall, fight, create love. Live extreme and push your boundaries. Why? Simply because there will be no other time for you to do this. You're going to die. You can't get out of life alive. Live your life now. Live your dreams now. Start acting like this is your last day on the planet. I don't care how young or old you are, age is a number and nothing more, and should be determined by experience, by what you have done and tested, how many times you have pushed your limits and broken down. You can become whatever you want, it's you that has to want it, it has to fight for it. It doesn't matter about the money, because when you truly love something, money is no object, it appears. When there's a will, there's a way. When you truly need something, you can find a way, and you stop at nothing to reach it. But you've got to work on yourself. You've got to develop yourself. You've got to talk to yourself day in and day out. Selling yourself on you and on your potentials. I'm coming out here first. I'm going to get my head out. I'm going to get my thinking out. I'm going to get my mentality out. As soon as you decide to stop looking for answers in other people and miracles somewhere down the yellow brick road and click the heel to your mind, you could have been free years ago.